Today we will begin to learn about the vessels of the Coptic Church. When the priest prays the liturgy, he would need wine. What is wine? Wine is like juice made from red grapes. We call it abarca. The deacon would bring the wine and water in small bottles called cruets. Where does the priest pour the wine into? The priest would pour the wine and water into a cup called the chalice. The mixing of the wine and the water is a symbol of the miracle that happened on the cross when blood and water flowed out after the soldier pierced Jesus' side. The chalice would be silver or gold in color, usually with beautiful designs engraved. The chalice is held upright by the ark, which is a box made from wood or plastic. It would have a picture of the Last Supper in the front, facing the priest, and pictures of saints around the other walls. The chalice would be put into the ark through the hole at the top, which can be opened from both sides to make the hole larger. During communion, the priest would use the spoon, which is also called the mystir, to give the blood of Christ to the people. In the liturgy, the priest says, Take, drink of it, all of you, for this is my blood. This do in remembrance of me. This is our Lord's promise of salvation given to those who drink his blood. Through his precious blood may our Lord permit us to drink from the everlasting fountain. We will see you at the next video to learn something new about our church.